Hi guys, welcome back to this YouTube channel. For those who keep coming back, thank you so much for the love, the support. I appreciate it, it a lot. If this is your first time stopping by, you're welcome to stay. Now for today, I'm doing a tutorial on how to keep your brushes clean. How to keep your brushes as white as they were when you bought them. Very nice and um, clean for yourself and for the makeup artist, for your client as well. And to make sure that they smell, you know, very, very good. Okay, so that's what this tutorial is about. I hope that you find it useful. Now, if you do find it useful, kindly share, okay, to the world and let people know how to clean their brushes as well. And if you've not subscribed yet, kindly hit the subscribe button below and don't forget to like the video. Thanks again and I'll see you in my next video. And oh, I'm wearing rosé lashes. This is in New York. My next video is going to be on that so yes um i'll see you in my next video bye starting off we are going to need kirkland disinfecting wipes i like to use this because it gets on with the dead off first before we go in with the soap and then for soap you are using palm olives gourmet spa this is the strawberry one i love this because after the brush is dry it leaves a very great smell on the brushes so you can get any nice smelling soap and then finally coconut oil from skin gourmet first off we are going to start cleaning the brushes okay we clean all of the brushes first um, this step makes cleaning the brushes with the soap and oil easier for me because it gets some of the dead off so see how good the wipes are See how it takes like dirt off the brushes. So yeah, I'm just going to rub the brushes on the wipes in circular motion. I'm going to zoom in so that you see how much dead this actually takes off. See how brown it was before now. See how it is now. Good thing is you can do this every day, every single day. Cleaning them with wipes. After after beating your own face or after beating your client's face is easier. Okay. If you don't want to be going every single day with soap, water and coconut oil. You can just do this. These wipes are really, really good. I'm pouring some soap onto a saucer and then I'm pouring some, I'm going to pour some coconut oil as well. Now I changed the bottle because this one has a smaller tip for precise pouring. It's still a skin remain bottle so yeah. So I'm going to take some soap and then to moil just showing you how much I'm taking and then rub in my palm okay vigorously because you want to be able to take away all of the dirt okay we are trying to get the brush to how white it was we are cleaning the brush so yeah see how much dirt that's gone off and then okay so the reason why i wash the brushes up to end is because you don't want water going directly into your brush bristles which will weaken your bristles and then it will start to fall out in no time that's if you do this process often 
okay so that's the reason now if you're not satisfied with how the brushes are clean good thing you can go back and do it again so to ensure that the brushes come out white you know very white and very nice so same process rub in your palm in circular motions making sure that all sides of the brush are clean after this step i'm going to dry it on a towel still upturned what happens is that the towel also will soak the remaining water okay in the bristles upturned because if water went into the brushes or into the head um, or into the metal <laughs> it will just come you know onto the towel and then the towel also colors her up so that's why we are repeating the same step with all the other brushes until done okay so take some soap take some oil coconut oil and then wrap it in your palm vigorously making sure that all sides of the brush get clean and then rinsing it upside down with water The good thing about this is you can use it to clean your beauty blender as well so I'm just going to soak up the rest of the soap and oil on the sofa I'm just going to soak it all up using the beauty blender and then we are going to clean the beauty blender up nicely you see how it will come out in the end I'm just going to press you know um, keep pressing it and turning it around I, I wish I could explain how I'm doing this but I'm just really trying to get out all the dirt you know it already has soap and oil so it's just making it easier to clean okay we are going to do that until all the dirt comes out and then we're that now See what happens. Actually, get out all the dead, everything, everything, and your beauty blender is neat and well cleaned. Okay. Yes, guys. So that is it. How to clean your brushes and now your beauty blender. I hope that you found this video useful kindly share this video for me and um i'll see you in my next video i appreciate you coming back to watch all of my videos thank you thank you so so much bye